Hi guys, I know a lot of you have been requesting some meditations. So um, every week I'm gonna try and do some sort of SEL connection with you guys. Um, I'm just gonna start with one of our um, body scan meditations today, um, but I'm looking for feedback from you, whether you want me to record um, longer meditations, if you'd rather me do yoga sequences or whatever it is that, that you guys think would be helpful for me to include every week in our newsletters. Always optional, of course. Um, so for the body scan, I know you guys are usually sitting at your desk and you put your head down on the desk and you can feel free to do that. But when you're not in a classroom setting, I think there's two good positions to be in for a meditation. One is you can be comfortable sitting in a chair with the back maybe up against it um, just so that you have a lot of space for breathing so sitting up straight and comfortable and then being able to close your eyes is a really great position for meditation the other thing is you can just lay flat on the floor um, laying flat on you know a rug or a carpet or a, a, a yoga mat or even on your bed would be fine as well and then you get the added bonus of maybe if you fall asleep you're already laying down. <laughs> so I'm gonna start us off just from a seated position, but you do what works for you. <clears throat> so just try and disconnect for a minute. I'm gonna stay seated. I have my hands just resting comfortably on my knees. Bringing your attention to your breath. And if you're sitting, try and equal out your weight on both sits bones. Try and keep your hips, your chest, your shoulders, your head in a nice line. Not arching with the back, but just keeping it in a nice line. Roll your shoulders back and down away from your ears. And on your next inhale, see if you can expand in all four directions. So not only should you have your abdomen going out, but see if you can have your back body expand and your sides expand so that you get this four directional breath. And on your exhale, make sure you're pressing all of the air out before you take in a nice inhale again. And if it feels right for you, try and make your exhale slightly longer than your inhale. And what I mean by that is, if you could count to four on your inhale, see if you can count to six on your exhale.
and now see if you can add a pause in between your inhale, your exhale, and your inhale. So I'll try and demonstrate that. So inhale, pause, exhale six, pause, inhale four, pause, exhale six, six, and now return to whatever breathing is comfortable for you, trying to guide it into your abdomen and getting full expansion. And start to notice your feet. Relax your feet. Bring your attention to your legs. Relax your legs. Bring your attention to your back. Relax your back. Notice your belly and chest. Relax your belly and chest. Roll your shoulders back and down away from your ears. Relax your arms, hands, and fingers. Bring your attention to your face. What can you let go of in your face? Move your jaw. Unfurl your brows. Squish up your face and let it go. Relax your neck. Head. As you feel your whole body relax, let go of any extra thoughts that are taking you away from your body right now. You can always return to them later. Gently suggest to them, not now. And focus on your breath.
in when you're ready. Wiggle your fingers and toes. Start to open your eyes. Give yourself a good stretch. You can place your right hand down, left hand over and stretch to the right side, leaving both sits bones on the ground. Switch sides, left hand to the ground or chair, right hand overhead, both sits bones stay on the ground. Bring both hands up to the sky. Hands kiss. Hands to heart center. And you finished a meditation at home. Namaste.